Hi everyone and welcome to And So On. My name is Lisa and today I have some amazing free patterns for you. Okay, so today I have an amazing bunch of new free patterns. Most of them are brand new to the market. Some of them are new to me. And the best part is that some of the websites I'm gonna show you have multiple new free patterns. So I'm gonna give you my sources so that you don't have to wait for me to post these videos. You can run over, join their mailing list and get them sent right to your inbox. Okay, so before I get to that, I do wanna thank the sponsor of this video, and that is LDH Scissors. And I'm guessing that you've probably heard of LDH Scissors. They make high quality cutting tools for sewists, for crafters, for quilters, and they have a very curated range of scissors, rotary cutters, snips, and pinking shears. That's what I saw on their website. And I had heard of them before. I had seen a couple of sewists use their rotary cutters that I thought were beautiful. And so I reached out to see about finding out more about their products. And one thing I did not realize is they're based in Canada, which is amazing. They originally were in China and then the family moved over to Canada and they continued the business in Toronto. So this is all the packaging and everything is designed in Toronto, which is where I'm from. So LDH stands for Love Dedicated happiness and I love that on the thing it says a box full of ideas because it's all about the creativity and having the amazing tools to be able to create what you want to create I'm going to show you a close-up of the scissors in one second but one thing that was interesting is Ursula one of the owners when I spoke to her she said okay well tell me more about what kind of scissors do you use? What hand do you use? Um, do you find them comfortable? Do you ever have hand pain? Like all these questions that I was like, gosh, I never even, I never really thought about that. And I said, well, I'm left-handed. And she said, oh great, well we have left-handed scissors. And I thought, I haven't been offered left-handed scissors since I was like seven in grade two. And you know, you'd be in the crafting corner and there'd be three pairs of left-handed scissors. Put a comment below if you're left-handed or someone in your family is left-handed. So one thing that really tickled me when I opened the box is it's got an information troubleshooting guide for left-handed scissors. And one of the big questions is why can I not cut with these scissors? And they said the, the most likely reason is you've gotten used to using right-handed scissors as a left-handed person. And so you almost have to relearn how to cut with your left hand. So that really tickled me. I thought that was really funny. And so it did feel strange, I'll admit, to pick up left-handed sewing shears, like, you know, not just like little snips, but like full, full scissors. And uh, although I won't say that I had to relearn how to use them, like I was able to cut with them right away. I think the angles, like of how you hold your hand to get a straight cut and all that, I thought did take me a couple minutes to go, oh yeah, okay, I just need to, you know, kind of move this here and move this there. Okay, so do head over to LDH Scissors and have a look at what they have to offer. I have an affiliate link below. I'm gonna put it in the description box and I think you're gonna be really, really excited to see what they have on offer. Okay, so now let's get to the free patterns. I'm so excited. Make sure that you comment below and let me know which ones you're gonna run over and grab right away, which ones you're gonna to add to your summer make list. I can't wait to hear. So to start off, we have this pattern from Lydia Naomi called the Angie Tank. I thought this was absolutely adorable. I love that it's fully lined. I love that it has such a wide range of sizes. I think it's something that could be really made up in many different fabrics to give you lots of different looks. It also has a full video tutorial and really excellent instructions. As you can see, it's got a really great size range. And then next we have from Le Dressing de Cindy, this really cute little dress pattern. It has some fun straps at the back that you can also do. It's called the Vazi, and I love all those different versions. Again, it has a fairly good size range, not humongous, but not bad. And I think for a free pattern, it's a really great one to go over and have a look at. All you have to do is join her mailing list. There's a closer look there about the size range if you wanna pause. And yeah, you can have a look there and follow the tutorial. The Bernina website, the, the, the German one, always has really good free patterns and you just have to change your browser to English. I love this little shirt dress. It's from this book. So these this series of books, they'll have different free patterns that come out of it and you don't have to enter an email address or anything. You just click on the link and it will automatically take you to the download, which is really handy. And then the instructions are right here on the Bernina blog as well. You'll find lots of other free patterns along the side there. And yeah, it's a really cute free pattern. 
In that vein, here's another one from the Bernina website, and it's an instruction on how to do shearing, meaning doing a smocked dress. And the nice thing about this is it's just done to your measurements. Very simple, the design and the calculation to do your own smock dress. It's the kind of thing you could make up in an afternoon and have ready in time for date night. Next is Unfettered Patterns, which is quite new to me. And this website has lots of free patterns that I think are absolutely adorable. There's a place at the top where you can donate to support them. And it's all on their blog, but they have a really nice size range, perhaps not as big as others, but for free patterns, it's not too bad. I like all of the instructions. They're easy to download. I really would like to make this uh, mono. I think it's a really, really cute one. And look at all the different options. Like if you just go through on their homepage, there's so many different things to make. And right now they're adding new patterns weekly or even a couple times a week. Next we have Tiana's Closet, which is something I've seen a bunch and I haven't actually made anything from their website. If you've made something from them, please do let me know below. But I love this little top. I think this is absolutely sweet and great to use with some of my small cuts of knit fabrics. And also they just have such a range of different patterns. Really, really interesting. Next is another French company and they have a free pajama pattern. I actually think this would be adorable just as a dress. I think you could really lengthen that. It looks like it's fully lined, the top part. I love the tie detail, beautiful in silk. I believe it's called Anad is the name of the, of the company. And yes, it's in French, but again, if you are a confident sewist, that won't stop you at all. You just figure it out on your own, no problem. From Common Stitch, we have this no waste dress. This again is great for summer, the willow waste free dress. Um, they have a video that gives you all the instructions to do it, or you can also use the instructions in the pattern. It is pay what you can. Um, have a look here at the download. Again, you just click on it and download. It's really easy and you don't have to enter a whole bunch of information. Really, really sweet. The Inez top is another one that just came out recently. It came through in my inbox. And I just think that t-shirt is really sweet. I like the button placket. You don't see that very often. And they've got the full printing instructions and everything like that so that it's all very, very clear how to put it together, etc. And then here's the breakdown of the sizing. Again, not the largest sizing, but with a t-shirt, hopefully you can extrapolate if necessary. Threads Magazine has a zero waste sundress. I haven't done any of these zero waste patterns yet. Have you guys? What's your thought? I've heard mixed things in terms of, you know, what kind of fit you can get, but look at that cutting pattern. I just think that that is so fascinating that you could just make all of those lines, cut that out and not have anything left over. I think that's pretty great. Um, I'd be tempted to try it, but I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. Let me know if you've tried something like this. Really interesting though. DIY Daisy has the Maya ruffle dress and top. And this is very sweet. Again, for summer, really, really cute. I love that sleeve detail. I love how sweet and like flowy it is. Um, you can make it a dress, you can make it a top. Yeah, look at the ruffle on that sleeve. Really, really cute. And again, it's zero waste. So just make all those marks, cut it out. It's perhaps, again, not a huge size range, but with all the ease, I think it's pretty flexible and you could make it to any size that you would need. Gina Renee Designs has this free dress sewing pattern for a, a halter neck dress in a knit fabric. I love the color she's done with it there. So pretty. I could definitely see this for summer. You could even shorten it. You could make it top length, um, really sweet. And then she also has a couple other free patterns as well if you pan down. The Petite Stitchery, this one's new. I haven't seen this one before as well. Um, the adult get together dress. I can see making one of these for my daughter. She wants a t-shirt dress for summer. I love the pockets. I like the little tie to give some definition at the waist. Um, you know, you could have hemmed or cuff sleeves. They always have really great patterns. And again, this goes up to 4XL. So it's got a really great size range. Lastly, we have a dress for Andrea. I put a picture of this in one of my previous sewing pattern uh, videos, but I didn't end up featuring the pattern. And some people said to me, what pattern is that? What pattern is that? So here it is. Um, this is from Istex and here is their pattern, Hammer's Etex. And you can go over and have a look at that. Again, not a huge size range, but if it works for you, it is really, really cute. And that's all. Okay, that's all of them. What do you think? 
I thought there were some really great original designs in there. Uh, I think there's some amazing sources that I'm going to go back to every month and check on and see what they have to offer. I hope that you will too. So if you love free patterns, please do give this video a thumbs up so I know to make more. I do try to make one or two a season regarding free patterns. I also sometimes add free knitting patterns or free crochet patterns if you're into that. Please do subscribe so that you'll be the first to see a video when it drops. And I can't wait to make more for you guys coming up. Okay, guys, that's all for me. I am off. I hope that wherever you are, the sun is shining, but not too hot, and that you are enjoying your crafting time. I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.